Our top story, a prescription by nurses for a safe reopening of the Boston Public Schools. This morning, school nurses expressed their demands with a sit-down protest at City Hall Plaza. The demands include rapid testing for the coronavirus, personal protective equipment, safe building ventilation, and space for isolating students with infections. We need uh, protective gear for the nurses. We also need protective gear for students and for, and for, and for staff. We need, uh, the buildings need to be safe. There needs to be adequate ventilation and we need to have that documented and we need to know that in fact that there is enough ventilation in these, in these schools and that we need soap and water. Many nurses offices don't even have a sink. We have nurses with master's degrees. We have nurses who are nurse practitioners who specialize, who have master's degrees in, in um, public health. We have master's degrees in, in school nursing, but we're not being brought to the table to help make decisions to keep our staff and our students and their families safe. And we need that. We need to collaborate. We need them to use our expertise so that we can all stay safe. People can tell you things that we're gonna have them, but if we're not actually part of the plans, how do we know we're really getting them? When are we getting them? Are we really gonna have them for September 10th? I don't know because nobody's included us in the plans. We have gotten no assurances that safety and health protocols are in place. We have no details of plans and there are still so many questions left unanswered that it doesn't make sense to push for a September 10th opening in hybrid where anybody's going back to school in person when we have so many questions left unanswered.